just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight. It's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So. It's a middleweight matchup between Robert Whittaker and Israel Adesanya. You ready? You ready? All right, so here we go with round one between Robert Whittaker and the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Australia and New Zealand at times are aligned, just certainly not in this matchup tonight. Not tonight, not tonight, because both of these guys both want to win this fight. They're two of the most talented martial artists in the world, and both feel as though they have the perfect style to beat the other. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach. Oh! Oh, nice punch there by Adesanya. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, you can hear the thwack from here as he lands another leg kick in DC. Now we're seeing visible damage as that leg starts to redden. And now you start to see the damage. And now you start to see the limping of the opponent. Watch as he gets kicked in the leg, he's turning away. He can't even get any pressure on his front leg anymore. He is beat up. That leg has been tenderized by this young man. Ooh, what a punch. Leg kick. And they are exchanging leather early. Flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. Big body kick length. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent here very bad. Big elbows! Oh! Big knee to the body! Oh! Back to the feet! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. Knee to the body! Big combination. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Israel Adesanya gets hit by that leg kick. Lands the overhand punch to the head. Oh, big left hand. We'll see if he can follow it up. Now a knee. So we call on the fight stats here. These are unofficial, but strong numbers. 46 total strikes have now landed for the last style bender. Oh. Eventually, you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end this They talk about the feeling out process, getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Beautiful land there by Adesanya. You hear this crowd just sneaking out of his hand, oohing and on every time he advances. I mean, he just captures you. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Back to the feet. He got him. Get right here. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Combinations here. Oh, he told you off the top he had to reach 
advantage, and you saw it right there with that punch. Oh, big knee to the body. How'd he get that one home? Nice punch there. Oh! Oh, he's hurt, he's gone! He got him! What a fight! Beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. All right, coming up next, it's a middleweight matchup between Michael Bisping and Israel Adesanya. Ready. You ready to fight? Well, it's a venue that needs no introduction. The world's most famous arena, Madison Square Garden. Even for a Boston guy, I have levels of appreciation for the building. I mean, when you walk into MSG, you get chilled because you understand the history that comes with competing in this arena. Well, he's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this jump. Oh! Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you see him drive his shit into his opponent. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. This thing gets caught with that punch. Ooh, blocks the shot. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off, DC. I believe that the jab was lost in mixed martial oh! arts. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. Oh! Oh, man. That jumped out of your seat a little bit after that. Oh, I did because I have time driving kick like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. So we pull up the numbers here. 25 total strikes have landed for Israel Adesanya. Adesanya's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Straight punch lands. Oh, 
He might be out. Two minutes to go. This is such a crazy fight. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Nice punch there by Adesanya. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Now his opponent's really on the ropes. His opponent's on beat street. He's hurt so bad. I don't know what he's gonna do to stay in this fight. Bisping gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. Beautiful body kick land right under the elbow. Bisping gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Gotta shore up the defense here, though. Man, has he come out aggressively to start this fight and landing at a pretty good clip, too, connecting on a lot of shots up top to the body. Very technical striker, but tonight, really as aggressive approach as we've seen out of him in his UFC career. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. is extremely swollen now. That kick blocked by Bisping. Look at him working and trying to shut the liver down. Bisping gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Ready to fight. Ready. Second round here. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Just misses there with the left. Oh, what a shot to the body. He's trying to keep the poke face, but he's hurt very, very bad. that jab. Oh, that's right in. Oh, oh, he's there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Well, oh, he's out. It's over. Oh, my goodness. A near-perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week, played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. All right, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible